According to Bloomberg and some other U.S. media outlets, U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken plans to visit China in the coming weeks. Although neither Washington nor Beijing has publicly confirmed the trip, a visit to China by Blinken, if it comes true, would be a symbolic message. But it is fragile and does nothing to balance the increasingly comprehensive and deep tensions between the U.S. and China. The U.S. has recently often made statements hinting at not seeking a cold war with China and easing China-U.S. relations, but its actions have made the Chinese feel that the U.S. is intensifying its efforts to contain China's development and create military tensions. How can such tensions between China and the U.S. be relieved by a visit to Beijing by Blinken? China and the U.S. may at some point have a crisis, such as a coalition of warplanes or warships, and it may not be possible for both countries to completely rule out the risk of those conflicts. The two countries need to develop that kind of common confidence, and that requires interaction with each other's behavior to achieve it. For this reason, the U.S. Must first change its way of action in the Taiwan Strait and the South China Sea.